Hey folks, we're going to show you how to get up and started on Google Meet particularly really quick. Um, so if you open up a browser, ideally Google Chrome, and you come here to the address bar and you put in meet.google.com, you are going to be brought to the Google Meet site. Now you want to make sure you're logged in under your College Unbound account, and you'll know that if you come over here to the upper right corner and you hover your mouse over it, notice that it says college under uh, collegeunbound.edu as my email address. All right, so when you're ready, you will select new meeting. Uh, you can create a meeting for later, you can start an instant meeting, or you can schedule in Google Calendar. So let's take uh, create a meeting for later first. So you're gonna click that, and this is actually just going to give you all of your all the things that you need. It gives you the meet address, that is the address you want to go to to have your meeting, uh, and it also gives a dial-in number as needed. So honestly, you would just copy that info, click that little right there, and you might pop it into an email and send that to all of your students, or pop it into Moodle and uh, as an announcement, and maybe also on like the syllabus and course info section at the top. You could add that as a page or, or a section there. Um, so that's one way you could do it. Um, if you click start an instant meeting, it's actually going to pop you right into Moodle, uh, sorry, right into Google Meet fairly quickly. So you could click on it and it's going to say, here you go, you can start joining. It's going to ask you about this. I'm going to continue without microphone and camera because I'm using those for this recording. And then it actually just puts me right in here. And so it's gonna say, actually, you know, your meeting's ready. Do you wanna add others? And so I'm gonna select add others. And then it's gonna offer up other people that I can put, or I can just copy and paste a bunch of email addresses all at once into this uh, section here. So that's if I want to uh, just start the meeting instantly. And then finally, if I click new meeting and I click schedule in Google Calendar, it's going to kick me into Google Calendar, and it's going to actually already open up with an event. So I can put in, uh, I can put in uh, the title of it. I can set the time. So I might want to be like, yep, that's tonight's class. So we're going to do 5:30 to. Um, oops, let me get to 9 p.m. here. Oh, it took me to the next day. Scroll up a little. 8.30. There we go. Um, I can also set this for the entire semester. So I can click on does repeat and it can repeat weekly on Tuesday or I could customize it and decide uh, it will run weekly on Tuesday and I want it to end, uh, say, that first week in December. Sorry, in May. What am I talking about? So I can hit done. Uh, it automatically has Google Meet here. And then what I would want to actually do is over here, I'd want to copy where it says guess. I'd want to copy and paste all of my students' emails. And in this case, I probably want to, actually in all these cases, I probably want to both their college inbound email, and then I would also check uh, Campus Cafe to make sure to post, uh, to, to make sure to get their personal email too, especially in the, early in the semester, you'd want to do that. So I would put those in there. And then I would be all set and I would, one of the thing I would do is right here where it has Google Meet, I would actually copy the Google Meet information and I'll tell you why in a second. So I would save this and now everybody will get a calendar invite to this for all of the, you know, as I said, until it would be a Tuesday meeting uh, until May 10th. Now, um, I'm going to do that, and also because it's first, you know, maybe the first class, et cetera, I'm also going to open up an email, and I am going to, you know, send a message to them saying, hey, we're meeting on Google Meet. Here is the Google, you know, here's the Meet information. I look forward to seeing you guys, so that they get both a calendar invite, which they may not realize, understand what that is, and they also get a message from you. So that's how you would do it. Um, you just go to Meet, as I said, we, we go to meet.google.com, we can choose the particular meeting type, and then we can send that information out to them. Hope this is helpful. Let me know if you have any questions.